So guys, today is episode number 1,000. In fact, let's go ahead and look at this, 1,152. Topic title for today, Stronger Than You Think. Go ahead and write that down, Stronger Than You Think. I've been thinking about this a lot because all of us face pressure in life. Uh, times where we can feel pretty overwhelmed and the obstacles look too big to overcome. It, it becomes easy to feel like it's just too much that we just simply can't take it anymore. But yet what the scripture says is that God will not let you be tempted beyond what you can endure and that he will make a way of escape. Now, here's the reality for most of us. We haven't discovered all that's inside of us right now. And it probably seems unbearable, but the fact that God has allowed it means that you guys can handle it. He did not say that he would make a way of escape so that we can run from it or so that we can avoid it. He said it so that we can bear it. In fact, we can even look back at times that we did not think that we could go on. The pressure seems like it's unbearable, but somehow it just doesn't defeat you. You've got the strength to get up another day. You got up today and you kept going when you didn't feel like that you have anything left. Think about it. You have a 100% recovery rate, which is amazing. It didn't break you because you were designed to handle the pressure and you will be able to bear whatever comes your way. See, I know the, the, the pressures of life that all of us face, financial pressure, relationship pressure, uh, raising children pressure, dealing with an illness, you know, different kinds of pressures. Whatever you face, just remind yourself that you can handle it, that you have been designed for it. If you go around thinking that this is too much or I can't raise these kids or this pressure at work is just overwhelming, that is going to defeat you. Yet you can overcome the opposition. You guys will outlast the adversity. You've got to have the thinking that you can do all things. And though the obstacles may be big, you will overcome all of them. Sometimes the trouble takes just a little bit longer than you think, but you will outlast it because you were not created to fall apart when pressure comes. When you start seeing yourself as strong and empowered, you will not live overwhelmed. You will discover strength that you did not know that you had. So you've always got to keep in mind that you are bigger than whatever you are up against. Right now, you might feel weak. You might feel intimidated. You might feel overwhelmed. And I'm not saying to not feel those things. What I'm saying is to not let your feelings have the final say. Don't let your feelings run your life. Remember, you run your life based upon principles and habits. So you have to go by what you know not by what you feel. And when the pressure feels too much, you have to say to yourself, I can handle it. I will handle it. So the question becomes, are you seeing yourself the right way? Have you discovered what is inside of you? Whatever situation that you are in right now might seem overwhelming and the pressure feels unbearable, but I want you to keep in mind, it is not there to defeat you but instead there to help you discover the strength that you did not know that you had. And whatever pressure that you have going on from the outside might be great, but God already knew that you were going to face it, guys. To survive is one thing. When we're just making it through life all beaten down and feeling like it's unbearable, yet you were not created to survive, but to thrive. And so this is my message for you guys today. It is my Valentine's message that you are stronger than you realize, that you can do more than you think that you can right now. And now we just have to go out and we have to do it. So guys, with that, happy Valentine's to each and every one of you. This is Brandon Boyd signing off. Have an absolutely fantastic day. We'll talk to you guys very, very soon.